Welcome back to YouTube. Welcome back to your journey YouTube channel where we talk about spirituality, self empowerment, talk about free form growth, and all of them wonderful things there. So tune in, like, comment, share, subscribe. Today we'll be um, doing a ACV lock detox. So ACV rings lock detox, re lock detox, right? So these are things that you are going to need for uh, ACV lock detox. And but first, before we go into that, about what you will need, let me explain to you what a uh, ACV rings lock detox does for your hair. All right. So. As you know, dreadlocks is coil here that coil and match together, right? During that whole process, you will get lint, lint build up in your ear, dirt build up, grime build up, maybe even mold if you're not really taking your eating good. And an ACV lock detox get rid of all of that. It's literally a detox to the hair. The same way like you take green juice or whatever for detox the body, an ACV lock. ACV rinse, detoxes the ear, get rid of all of the toxicities, the whatever, whatever, dirt, grime, if anything will have to pick up over time, right? So, we do an ACV lock, uh, lock detox, ACV rings, rinse every three months, three to four, every three to four months. I'm gonna do it often, simply because I keep my ear very clean. I have a wash routine of every three days, so my locks don't really get dirty like that. You know, so like every four months, every three to four months, we do a lot of detox. So these are the things that you are going to need for the ACD lock detox. Uh, rinse is apple cider vinegar, bronze brand. Get the organic one with um, the mother. Yeah, this like, this is the best one for. Her. So yeah, the organic with the mother. This is the strongest one. So it literally, it's very acid. Take out everything out. It literally melt all of the deep the toxicity. <laughs> It melt all of the toxicity in your ear and get it out. So these are the best one for buy. Yeah. We can we can see. Good. Yeah. They never need some lime. Our lemon. Anything. So I have key lime. I have key lime. So I'm gonna use two of them here. And this. And also this. For the baking soda. You don't know. I have to use warm water. To the drink. And it is my little wash thing when I go do my ear now because you can use a sink to or a bathtub or whatever. If it what I don't know, you can use a sink, but this is what I'm gonna use for the inflatable um bath thing for just wash it. You can get it by Amazon for maybe twenty dollar, yeah cheap. And then I just fill up that with warm water. I'm not going to show you everything, man. Just tune in, tune in. It should be warm. So, yeah, I can throw lemon in the water too. No matter. I hear it again, anyways. The lemon can't suck in your dreadlocks, yeah. So, right, alright. So, next thing I'm going to have is the ACV. Well, the other side of it, I'm going to show you things there. That's all I need. As I said, my locks are not really that dirty because I have a wash routine up every three days. Yeah, my locks clean. Like, I'm not really clean. Now I'll give me some trouble. Then now the baking soda. Well, alright, it's not freeze, so here for Well, it just not freeze. But I mean, it needs more of it. Yeah. Ooh, it's sizzling. Yeah. Alright, that's what they're looking for. Okay. And then you submerge your ear in the water for 20 to 30 minutes. Yeah. Give it a little massage, you know, to get the thing in, to get all the dirt and grime out. You know, for massage, it's for all like 20 minutes. Just give it a little massage for like maybe a minute or in between, you know. 
get deep into massages and whatever. It's up to you, you know. Alright guys, so this is how the water look after 20 minutes of detox. As I said, my ear not really that dirty. Well, it brown, so it kind of loves some things in it, same way. But, you know that dirty, like you see some people, do ACV and the water black, you know. Come have a, a regular wash routine. And I think everybody should have a regular wash routine, whereas if you have locks. Every three years or at least once a week, you know. Alright. Guys, so this is how the year look after the lock detox. I let us saw the water change completely from clear to a brownish color. That's all of the dirt grime build up, you know, from lint, dirt, dust outside. You know, a lot of things get trapped in the locks because the air actually and not up itself and I do a lot of things so that whatever dirt get caught up in it or just get trapped so the detox is needed with a little lime seed or so look over the little thing yeah so the lime baking soda and apple cider vinegar yeah man that is the last detox alright so that was the ACV rings um, like comment share subscribe to the new YouTube channel that is how the channel grow guys Leave the comments down below. Have you ever done an ACV ring before? If you still miss anything where well, like you know, put a add, you can leave that too. And yeah, just comment. The comments help to make the channel reach way more people. Likes help, you know. So like, comment, share, subscribe. And yeah, let the channel grow. Uh, I'm gonna say, you know what the channel is all about. It's about self-empowerment. And it's about helping that's what they are doing. We're trying to help each other so. Like, comment, share, subscribe to your new YouTube channel. And now we do a complete 360 right now for you like this. Then come and lock them in the back and everything. As I told you before, I'm going to shave the sides of my head. So, yeah. I do a complete 360 now so you can see the whole shebang. You see? Alright, good. So, this is the back. My ear wet. That's why you see here. I just come out of the ACV rinse. Congo. Congo. And Congo is my favorite locks. I like big Congo. I guess I'm going to do a little manicure business. Cause yeah. Congo. I love the Congo, man. I see. <laughs> Let me know what you think about Congo locks and all them things. Comment man, drop some comments down in the rare, 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 is it? Yeah man. 